title in the Soul Star Chronicles in Chapter 1 in the Cosmic Connection in the universe where Earth was the epicenter of all creation, a place where imagination birthed realities in distant galaxies, humans carried a secret woven into their very essence. Each individual was quantumly entangled with a star, a celestial entity that mirrored their soul, a beacon in the cosmic sea that guided their fate and bestowed upon them a fragment of its luminous power. Chapter 2 In the Alien Revelation um, Years away, on a planet revolving around one such star, a civilization of beings had evolved. Their culture and religion, deeply rooted in the worship and understanding of their home star, which they revered as the giver of life and the source of all knowledge. Their astronomers, through centuries of celestial observations, stumbled upon a profound truth. The source of their star, their deity, was Earth, and more shockingly, it was intrinsically connected to a single human being. Chapter 3, the, the Chosen One. Back on Earth, a young woman named Arya lived an ordinary life, unaware of her cosmic significance. She carried within her the soul of a star, a connection that bestowed upon her dreams, filled with alien landscapes and a mind brimming with creativity and imagination. The day the alien delegation arrived on Earth marked the end of her ordinary life and the beginning of a journey that would transcend space and time. In Chapter 4, in the journey to the Soul Star, with a mixture of fear and awe, Ari embarked on a journey with the alien beings to their home world. As they traveled closer to her Soul Star, a transformation began to take place. Her senses heightened, her mind expanded, and her body became a conduit of immense power. A living testament to the celestial connection that bound her to the star. Um, in the ascension, um, upon arriving at the alien planet, Arya was greeted as a deity, a, a living embodiment of their star. She found herself capable of feats beyond human comprehension, a superhuman with abilities dictated by the proximity to her soul star, the alien society revered her, their culture evolving to incorporate the living deity amongst them, reshaping their religion and understanding of the universe. Um, and the Soul Star Doctrine. As Arya adapted to her new role, she began to teach the alien civilization the profound implications of the Soul Star connection. She spoke of unity, of the interconnected web that bound all beings to the cosmos, and of the potential for harmony and understanding that lay in the acknowledgement of this bond. She introduced them to the concept of Earth as the cradle of imagination, a place where dreams shaped realities and burst are. The Cosmic Renaissance, under Arya's guidance, the alien society entered a golden age of enlightenment, a period of cosmic renaissance where art, science, and spirituality flourished. The understanding of the soul star connection brought about a revolution in their way of life, fostering a society that lived in harmony with the cosmos, a civilization that revered the sacred bond between star and soul, and a culture that saw Earth not as a planet, but as the heart of the universe, the source of all creation. Uh, chapter 8, in the Universal Harmony. As years passed, Arya became a bridge between worlds, a messenger of the cosmic doctrine that spoke of unity and the divine connection between all beings. She facilitated a dialogue between Earth and the alien civilization, fostering a universal harmony that transcended boundaries and brought about a new era of peace and understanding, where beings from different worlds could coexist, sharing knowledge and celebrating the divine connection that bound them to the soul. And the legacy of the soul star. Um, in the end, Arya chose to return to Earth, her home, carrying with her the knowledge and wisdom acquired through her journey. 
she became a beacon of light, a living testament to the soul star connection, a symbol of the divine bond that connected all beings to the cosmos. Through her teachings, Earth began to understand its role as the creator, the nurturer of stars and souls, and the profound responsibility that came with being the center of the universe, a place where dreams shaped realities and where imagination birthed worlds beyond comprehension. The story of the soul star became a legend, a cosmic doctrine that spoke of unity, love, and the infinite potential of the human spirit, a tale that transcended time, space, and the boundaries of imagination weaving a tapestry of interconnected destinies, 